my name is Jackie welcome back to my channel um, I'm on a bit of a weight loss journey and I'm currently doing keto well lazy keto I guess you'd call it if you hear lots of noises before I had to say beginning I've got two kittens and they're running around the house um, so so I do apologize if you hear banging so for today I'm just going to show you my haul um, which I bought from Sainsbury's this week I'm so sorry <laughs> they're like pumped for a weekend they love it when we're home just run around um so yeah this is from sainsbury's which is just a chain here in the uk um so like any chain really and i have bought this pretch stuff i'm showing you it's pretty much for me some of the meat i'll be sharing with my partner so i'll flip you around and show you first of all what i bought so this is my haul for the week and i'll just talk you through what i've grabbed so i've got my usual two bottles of dr dr pepper i know i know but you know um, I bought myself some squirty extra thick cream. This is the one that has like per serve 0.3. So uh, I have that with jelly when I have uh, jelly jello because um, it's a nice dessert. I've got a few of those in the fridge. I've got a bit excited on the old chicken this week. I bought some chicken breast that's all normal. have gone up again <laughs> and the thighs as, as well. And I'll be doing using those this week for meal prep. Um, as well as a actual raw chicken so it is a chicken party um i'll be cooking the chicken just for sunday um i do one probably once every six weeks more in the winter i think um this i'm going to make um peri peri chicken and this is just for the week for using whenever we feel like it i bought um some from the polish section which i love even though i am not polish um peri polish bacon just to chop and, and enjoy. There we go. Uh, back of radishes, which I will roast. We're, we're having the chicken tomorrow. Yeah, Sunday. And my partner will be having potatoes and I'll be having radishes. Got this pack of chicken here. To be honest with you, my cats will probably nick most of that. They love eating my food. I've got a pack of cauliflower rice, which will probably be going with the peri peri chicken. Another bar of this chocolate, which I haven't actually eaten last week yet. Um, it's still in the fridge. Um, yeah, I'm rubbish. A uh, pack of salt and vinegar peanuts, which I believe are not keto, but I, I mix them up with other nuts, like hazelnuts, almonds, um, Brazil nuts, and macadamias, and make my own blend. I just fancy them because of a salt and vinegar flavour to make something a bit more interesting. I've got a pack of mature cheese. Um, got some uh, mixed rice and vegetables, which... I've had a bit of a, a carrot revolution this week where I've kind of avoided carrots because of the carbonous, but um, I also bought tins. So these ones are no added sugars. Half a can, which is a good portion, is only 2.6 carbs. So I'm kind of putting the carrots back on the table um, this week. So I bought a few tins just for the cupboard because the freezers are really full. Um, so I've got a bag of mixed veg as well. This is just so useful for everything. I'll probably add some to everything. Um, just to get, you know, get my fibre up. Um, because it tastes good. And um, I also bought my cheeses this week. And I also did stir fry. I basically ran out of everything. Um, so I've got Chinese spice, five spice, some soy sauce and some ginger and garlic paste. Because I do like ginger. So that is my little haulette for the week. And this is my meal plan for the week and sort of reflecting a little on last week. Um, I've kept my workout plan, first of all, the same. Oh, God, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I was like running around. Um, so I've kept my uh, plan the same. Um, this is what I actually also planned for last week. Uh, it didn't go to plan because I have um, basically mid-morning on Monday, uh, I both get up for work early and do some home workouts. I didn't any day last week. I was exhausted because... I had really bad sciatica. I get that on and off probably about once a year. It re re rears its head. I've had it since I was about 14 when I uh, used to work on a farm, believe it or not. And I had repetitive injury from being packing actually eggs, if I'm honest. And um, I got really, really bad sciatica, you know, as a teenager on your first job. Um, so it just started to flare up. So I had to completely adapt my complete workout plan. So I didn't do anything in the mornings. I was tired from it. You've ever had sciatica or backache? Um, you get that. As soon as you start doing something, it just takes your breath away. Um, being in pain on and off most of the day is very tiring. So I apologise. I didn't get up and do a home workout. 
but I also had to adapt to my plan. I couldn't do any lifting. Um, so I could do strength training or kettlebells. So I basically did lots of walking workouts. Oh gosh, they're so bad. Um, and I do a really, I do YouTube channel videos and I did a channel called Up To The Beat. And it's very, very lovely, positive, happy lady called Gina. She's Australian and she does really good, just walking fast um, to music, really. I think it's for oldies. I'm an oldie, so it's okay. Um, so, um, but I just did quite a, I did about half an hour a day of those. Um, and I did just a walk at lunchtime to get out because I, I couldn't, I didn't want to go to the gym. I just, I actually kind of bent over a little bit just to walk around. Um, and today, Saturday, and I was so shy, and I woke up at half eleven. <laughs> and I'm not going to work out yet. It may happen, but um, there you go. I tried. To, I promised myself I'd do four days a week. I actually did five. Um, I did a different video-ish thing every day. I was hoping to do a sixth day. I don't think it's going to happen today. I really feel really out of it and exhausted. But I'll plan again to do the same. This plan next week um, and try again. So. Um, in terms of my eats for next week, I've got a couple of sort of got a question mark here, but during the day, eggs, bacon, and sausage. I've got some of those. Um, I've got some olives, which I need to eat because they're a couple of weeks old, and obviously my usual cheese and nuts. There's nothing really exciting there. It's all very low carb during the day. And in the evening, um, I've got these. I've got those a few weeks back on a haul. I showed you my uh, these noodles, they're protein noodles made from fish protein, and I really have been putting off eating them. But I'm going to bite the bullet and do a prawn noodles on Monday. Tuesday, I'm going out for dinner with all my colleagues. Um, I don't even know where we're going. So it's going to be probably a steak. Because that's when you go to a restaurant, it's always usually a steak on the menu and salad. No potatoes, you know, that kind of thing. I just know they're going to be egging everyone on for cocktails and, you know, those sort of things. So I'm going to have to be good. I've got beef and dress in the freezer, which I'll be eating. Gosh, they're wrecking my house. Um, sorry, I had to go and tell the kittens off. Um, so I've got a beef madras um, which, in the freezer, which is what I cook them for. I keep them to make my little food bank in the freezer. I'm going to have the other pack of noodles because I've got to be eating. I've got some chicken. And um, I'm going to have, I think, a Thai chicken on Friday, possibly. Saturday, I had a thing called a mixed plate where I just empty what's in the fridge that I can eat and shove it on a plate, eat the scraps, basically bits of leftover chicken or eggs or a bit of cheese, just get rid of everything. And I think on Sunday, I'm going to cook a pork shoulder um, and just do some veggies with it, and that'll last us a few days. Um, I also have, I'm also cooking this week some um, sort of peri peri chicken and veg. So uh, again, there might be some swap outs this week with these. I will probably I'll let you go know the guys know next week, see how that goes. But that is my meal plan for the week. Thank you very much for joining me. Sorry about all the noise. <laughs> they need to go to sleep quite soon. Um, and I will be joining you on Monday for my weigh in and during the week for probably a full day of eating. Um, so thank you for joining me for my haul. Um, and I'll see you soon.